Hey everyone, got my Whiteout Series Long Strike that I've been testing Orange Mod Works Massacre Kits on. Uh, the Long Strike one is installed in this. Earlier I was having issues with the 6 kilogram spring in this, making a single hand prime extremely difficult. Um, to the point where it was also pretty much tearing up the internals of my blaster. The stress that was caused from trying to single hand prime that so often was causing unnecessary stress on... Uh, now I have a stock uh, breech that's mounted here, but at the point where it meets... I'll show it to you closer. At the point where it meets here is where the breech actually broke, and I'm I'm assuming that the stress from trying to single hand prime that um, weakened this connection here because this bolt sled still has enough um, still has enough give for it to bend inside, and when you tried to single hand prime it, it would actually slide to the to the right or to the left depending on which way that you'd primed it. And that was causing stress on this connection point here. So I've got a stock part in there now, so I'm not expecting fantastic ranges out of this, what with a stock part in there and a 5 kilogram spring. But I wanted to show you how much easier this thing is to prime with a 5 kilogram spring in it. Look at that. That's a dry fire owl. Load a clip for you. Got a white dart installed in the last one. Now I'm still seeing a little bit of wiggle, but it's not popping off this uh, this other end here. And really, this guy's been weakened by getting shoved off from all the other times that uh, I had the six kilogram spring in there. So the part's actually doing quite well considering all the stress that it's gone through. So a single hand prime is more than capable on a uh, on a long strike with the five kilogram spring. If, uh, it's, it's not really that much of a performance decrease. Obviously, I got a little bit less range because I'm still using a combination of Orange Mod Works parts and the stock parts that are installed on there to make up for the broken parts. Um, but this is performing a lot better now. And uh, the next thing that I'm going to try out, um, I'm actually going to be combining two of the... Uh, Two of the kits that are now out there for the Long Strike, the Orange Mod Works Long Strike Massacre Kit with the 6 kilogram spring still installed in it, but instead of this single hand um, prime that I've been trying to do with this, because it'll have the 6 kilogram spring, I actually need to use a technique much like this. However, instead of going over the top like I learned from a gray house on the document, um, I'm actually purchasing the Explorer kit to fit over this. So with the 6 kilogram spring in there, getting the performances that it did before, but now being able to single hand prime this thanks to the Explorer grip that'll go on this, I think it'll be a nice combination to make the Whiteout Long Strike a beast to use in games. We'll see ya!